hello guys welcome back to our today's video and welcome back to my channel so if you've not subscribed to my youtube channel make sure you do so and uh, guys as you can see this is nairobi cbd uh, kenyatta avenue as you can see uh, a lot of people are not there in town today many businesses have closed as you can see on this other side but border borders are there as you can see here uh, we all know that there was going to be a strike today for the tra transport industry especially when it comes to public service vehicles but today most of them are there as you can see we have matatus they are operating but a number of people have not turned up today at work as you can see here this place is deserted as as of the normal situations there are normally a lot of people around this area this is kenyatta avenue as you can see guys as you can see guys a lot of people have closed their business because of the mandamano that is going to be there today but I know those most of those who have opened, I know maybe they will not uh, open the holiday because of what is going to be here today. But you, as you can see guys, people are not there around uh, CBD as much as I can say this is like 30%. And as you can see here, there is security. There's police around this area. I think a number of police are there to ensure that there is uh, there's a lot of security people around to ensure that there is no fracas or people's businesses are protected, guys. So that is the situation. Most businesses have closed, like literally, they have closed. Today, even there's no those who open in the morning and let her close on. I think there are just a few, very few who have opened. But I think for those who want to come to town, the transport services are there still. We don't know how it will turn up maybe in the afternoon. As you can see, that is uh, Metro and other, you know, Kenya bus, that is City Shuttle. But what I know is a lot of businesses have closed. As you can see in this street, uh, there's no businesses that have opened yet. As of what we thought of today that matatus won't be operating instead there are so many matatus around there are so many matatus around so we don't know how it will turn out at the end of the day as you can see most businesses have closed but here they have opened the streets are quite empty There's, uh, normally there's always traffic here but as you can see guys there is no traffic today on the roads there's no traffic there's totally no traffic around because I think most of the people uh, they have they have tension over the the mandaman thing empty streets empty streets this is uh, national archives and there's not so much going on here as you can see businesses over there are closed as
and this is Moy Avenue. It's uh, uh, quite busy. And and here there are a lot of security and also the Kanjo. Uh, as you can see guys this is uh, national archives that is the place there are not so much people walking around or going to work but as you can see around this area there is quite a number of if a few people I think they're here to avoid gatherings and stuff and people who run as you can see in the as you can see there they're there security people they are waiting for to throw up tear gas and stuff. <laughs> so that's an overview of the National Archives, as you can see guys. Here, people are there around. Security, they are there, waiting for They're there to ensure that people are safe and other businesses, people's businesses are safe, you know, guys. So, I can say that like 30% of the businesses are open, but most of them have not opened. Uh -huh. And this is Tomboya Street, quite busy, almost busy as usual, people are there, matatus are there, it's quite busy guys, as you can see. As you can see, my tattoos are there in plenty. I think they called off the strike. And also just just a few businesses have opened.